Nowhere to run, Sogan. You destroyed Clan Adachi. I was only a messenger. For who? Knowledge does not end suffering. You know nothing of suffering. Masako. I buried my family. One by one. It took days. But I'm going to leave you for the wolves we need him alive to tell us who he serves our world has changed men of vision must rise to face it and those in the way must be removed they were children <laughs> masako He, he was never going to talk. We still need information. There has to be something we can use. Search outside. I'll deal with things in here. Find me when you're done. Hmm. Names. And a symbol. Masako might know them. Where did you find anything? A list of names and a clan symbol. I found the same symbol on these men. I've never seen it before. A rival clan moving in to take control. We have to stop them. I will. You cannot do it alone. When my uncle hears of this, he will not rest until the traitors pay for what they did. Help me, and we will bring down everyone who hurt you. Together. When you need help rescuing your uncle, I will be there. Thank you, Lady Masako. Until that time, I have work to do. That's my kage.
<laughs> Lord Sakai, come quickly. Lady Masako, do you have news of your family's killers? On the list we found, Sada was at the top. He's the head man of Kuta Farnstead. Kuta's people served your clan. Why would he turn against you? Because he is an ungrateful traitor. My husband appointed Sadao as headman, and he repaid that kindness with bloodshed. I learned he fled Kuta the night my family was murdered. He must have heard you survived. Sadao is a deceitful snake, but his brother, Hachi, is a fool. He just passed by the temple carting food for the refugees. He will make an unscheduled delivery to his brother. And we will be there to catch him. We have to go, or we will lose him. After what happened at the inn, I didn't think you'd visit the temple again. I came to watch for Sadao's brother, and mourn Clan Adachi's dead. Have you given your family a proper funeral? Not while their killers walk free. After my father died, I said goodbye to him that same night. It helped ease my pain. I buried them. That will have to do. For now. When's the last time you slept? Or ate? I had some rice and fish yesterday. Even the youngest warrior needs a full belly and a rested sword arm. Are you calling me old, Lord Sakai? <laughs> I wouldn't dare. My sword arm works just fine. We should have caught up to Hachi by now. Which way do you think he went? Both roads look traveled. Let's search the area. He can't be far. Masako, look. The man with the cart. That's Hachi, Sado's brother. Is that stupid? Oh, ah, Stay hidden. Oh, all right. Back to it. And we will follow. Close, but out of sight. Behave yourself, Ringo. What nice weather for you. And we will follow. Close, but out, out of sight. Behave yourself, Ringo. Or no carry for you when we're done. What nice weather for a walk. Mongols, my old friend. You're on your own. He has visitors. We can't let them see us. Food? Water? Other things? Sure. Uh, of course. Not yet, but I have something for your guest. It's a meeting. We'll pass it along. He handed them a note. I'll stop here again at the usual time. We'll meet you then. Forget the wagon. Follow those horses.
to deliver, the headman will kill us. Sadaza. See From a bad family. His cousins are bandits. Remember the riots that erupted? When Kuta farmstead was sold on rice? Yes. Who do you think hired the bandits that slaughtered the protesters? Headman Sadao. The coward. I knew it. Right. So next time you think of the headman, remember the Kuta massacre. Woodcutter's house, guarded by bandits. Sada's cousins. He must be hiding there. We don't know that. But we will soon find out. Come here and fight! Corpses can't answer questions. There's someone in the house. I'll make them talk. Let me try first. <laughs> I 
I'm not going to hurt you. My name is Sakai. Who are you? Hina, Sada's wife. My husband is innocent. The Mongols killed your family. Where is he? I, I don't know. You're lying. She'll help us. And she can't stay here. I'll take her to my estate. She's going to kill me! No harm will come to you. <laughs> 